All right contestants, if you recall, the smiling friends lost, and the Mr. Men and American Dads have to choose who to vote out. So, let the voting begin. Oh my alphabet, I'm worried. I need to worry about it. Well, think about it. A cup won the prize twice in the span of three episodes, so we will have the advantage for that once he's gone. I mean, it doesn't really make sense to get rid of someone because they won the prize more than once. There is an actual threat between the four. And I say, Dora. Since we're on the topic of threats, Mr. Game and watching the fact he is flexing his advantage, so he's gone in my books. I would vote with Gumball, but I'm looking at Kilpin and he reminds me of Shake Kill. He's got my vote for sure. That's two votes Cuphead, one vote Dora, one vote Mr. Game and Watch, zero vote Sex. Wah! I feel being unpredictable, so I vote it. That is my reason, nothing personal. It's alright, I understand. I would love to vote with Wario, but Sex is cute and I want to put him in the bottom two and honestly, Dora is the bigger threat. So I vote for her. That's two votes Cuphead. Two votes Dora, one vote Mr. Game and Watch, one vote X, which means X and Mr. Game and Watch are safe. Well, at least my vote was nothing personal. Sandy, you're the last one to vote, so who do you vote for, Cuphead or Dora? Honestly, I feel like Dora could easily destroy the competition. I'm up for a challenge. But I saw how she did that tree, so she gets my vote. Oh yeah! Well then, Dora has the most votes, but she can potentially be saved. With what? Yes, you see, if someone has the most prize votes, then they are automatically safe for that elimination, and the person with the second most elimination votes would be eliminated instead. For example, if boyfriend had the most prize votes, then Mono would have been eliminated, so in order for Dory to be safe, she has to have the most prize votes. Let's see if that's the case. Well, X has the most prize votes, and he wasn't in the bottom two, so Cuphead is the last one safe. Yeah, that was close. Wait, what's my prize? I accept this. Well then, Dora, why don't you go explore the elimination place? Our team went from the smallest to the largest, that's the power of my team leader skills. Okay contestants, I'm going to teleport you all into different rooms. The challenge is to stay in them as long as possible. The first two teams to have all of their members leave will be up for elimination. So we just have to stay in this room, sounds easy enough. It may sound easy, but there might be some kind of twist and star. What makes you say that? Well, I've done many missions where I act like things are normal, but there is an unexpected twist, and I feel like this is too easy. I can see where you're coming from with the challenges so far have been fairly ten. Yeah, we all just have to wait and see if Stin is right. Alright, we've went from side members to a three in the span of five episodes. We need to win so we don't risk losing another member at Well! This shouldn't be too hard. We just need to stay in this room the longest. But look at it gets blown, man. I'm sure we can entertain ourselves for a while. Just stay in a room? Yeesh. That's the most boring challenge I ever heard. Maybe that's the point. To test how long you can stand being in here without much to do. Well, when someone says challenge, I expect something like a tie trope walk. Not this. I understand that, but sometimes something simple can be challenging. I don't see the big deal. It means that I can finally relax. See, he's happy. You know what? Forget it. 
So you still think there is a twist? Yes, the challenges are supposed to be challenging, not just to stay inside a room. It's gonna come when we all least expect it. I don't know. We've spent a fair bit of time in here and nothing's happened. And what you're thinking that? Gumball and Ezekiel are playing two trots in a light. Okay, two trots in a light? I got eliminated first twice, my honey is blood, and my cannon self turned into a frog beast. But isn't your honey drink? That's right, yeah, I ain't that too easy. Your cannon version turned into a what? If you don't think I'm right, then why don't you just get out? Maybe I will. See how it feels once we lose because of you. That's right, no one disrespects my team leader skills like that. Well, that's the fourth name of a hundred bottles of drinks on the wall. Now, bless boy, go. Yeah, and I only play games for times in a row, but you can guess why. Yes, that's exactly why. Pause of my best friend. Hang on, Mr. Game, I'm watching this and Todd mostly does stand around. He could give us an automatic win if we leave. I don't know. Something about that doesn't seem right to me. Well, join it later, people. I see where you're coming from, Monty. It is challenging to just do nothing for a long period. And frankly, me back in my Texas days would be annoying at me, so I leave. Good luck at y'all. Meh. We can still win even without that score. I don't get why you could send that like that. He was just stating his opinion. Listen, Cat, my team, my rule. It's your team, too. Just because you think there is a twist doesn't mean you can kick people out. And who taught you that, your mother? Me being homeschooled has nothing to do with this. Yeah, stand back up. Listen here, I'm only an adult in this room, which means I have authority over you both, so I suggest you both shut up. How about we just leave like you? See how long you can last all by yourself. Come on, he's a kill. Let's get it here. Honest, I don't even care if we lose. Let's just get away from this girl. That's right, I don't need other of you, but the only reason we know each other is because of this competition, and I can win all by myself. I can't believe Cafe just left because you spent your time standing. You are far more useful than that. Like an as a vibe where you took on Jeff and boyfriend and beat us win. You don't hold it against him. Wow, you're very forgiving. You want me to leave to so you can prove his point? Well, I don't want us to lose another member, but I don't need the bathroom. Meh, <laughs> I'm getting bored. Honestly, I am getting tired of standing on hardwood floors. I guess losing one more challenge wouldn't hurt. It's been 45 minutes and still no twist. Doesn't matter, I just have to wait patiently. One hour later. Oh, maybe I have to do something for the twist to appear. Maybe the door has something to do with it. Well, Mr. Game and Watch, you managed to stay in the room the longest, which means you win while the other teams are for elimination. Okay, so there was no twist, but my thinking was justified. So, viewers, vote for two contestants to be eliminated and two contestants to win the prize. Whoever gets the most elimination votes will be eliminated. Whoever gets the most prize votes wins the prize. Voting will end when the polls get taken off the description. Episode 10 will come out when it does.